Hi, it's me. Uh, I thought I'd share with you the process of making one of these large pyramids, which I started yesterday and started layering today. So the lights are already in there. And this one, you can't see until it's demolded. And I'm learning to be very patient, so I'm very happy about that. And this one is, uh, I tried to make it like an aquary colour. See? And that one also I've been layering. So that's got a lot of goodies in there that I won't be able to see until I demold. But I can't wait. I'm absolutely hanging. And I've already got uh, someone interested in an Egyptian themed organite pyramid. So I've got all this stuff to do to to create one of those so I'm going to do a prototype and see if she likes it so it'll be my first one after I not first well first Egyptian one yeah after I created the first one I got a really very good response and so I decided well now I'm going to continue to make them yeah so They're just very fascinating, the smaller ones that I'm making. And these will have lights in them, but they'll have, see these little tea light ones? See, boom, and then it's got the little um, flame. I haven't got it on now, but they're very effective, and there's no cord or anything like that. So, I'm yet to finish these ones, but these would be a more affordable version and you'll still get a beautiful piece of organite that's a pyramid that lights up so I can't wait to um, share and see what these come out like um, I've learnt to uh, <clears throat> here's a little tip for you if you work with a resin and you're working on a table make sure you cover the table because I ended up with a very lumpy table so now I've learnt to cover it with all sorts of Place mats and foil and and stuff. All right.